This SUV clearly missing its parking spot. Air Tracker 7 showing the vehicle minutes after it went through the front of this North Denver home. It happened right after school let out. So there were children inside. Two of them went to the hospital. Mark Stewart is live at 45th and Steel. Mark, an officer telling you the driver may have been drinking. In fact, Eric, when that car slammed into the front of the home, just footsteps from where we are here, the fire department tells us he tried to get away, got out of his car, ran out, and people in this neighborhood actually jumped on top of him, holding him until police could could take him into custody. Here's some video we shot right before it got dark, and you can see the twisted metal and planks of wood. Four kids inside at the time, relatives telling a nine-year-old and a 12-year-old inside got hurt, but they should be just fine. But the damage to this home, significant. When I see that, I was like, it's crazy because, uh, see, um, I don't even believe it. I mean, that's unbelievable. Something like that happens. Back here live, you can see that the house is still standing, but it is clearly not safe for anyone to be inside or to spend the night. A relative tells me the family here does have insurance. The company is helping them out with a hotel room for tonight, possibly even the days ahead. We're live in Denver tonight. Mark Stewart, 7 News.